Hey guys, so today I'm going to talk about Magic Duels and I was playing the game as some of you know that I purchased the game. Uh, when I mean purchased, I bought all those coins and I was recording the game and then all of a sudden it stopped working and it deleted my collection, it deleted my decks, my progress and it no longer connects to the server. But it connected, it honestly connected just long enough to bill me. Uh, according to uh, Apple, they billed me around 10 o'clock for the coins. Then I pretty much it stopped working around like 11 o'clock. And they took away my decks, they took away my progress, they took away my... So when you play Magic Duels, you actually have like a rating and that's multiplayer. So I was playing the game, it's really fun actually. I made some videos about it and now not because I don't have internet, I obviously have internet, and it just doesn't connect anymore. So then I went on Facebook, um, I commented on their Facebook, I commented on their Twitter, and I wrote them an email. I even made my own account to write them a problem email to tell them, hey, this is a problem. And apparently this has been a ongoing problem for a few days for the I iPad version, iPad Air version, as well as any of the iOS versions. Which leads me to the discussion is how did you collect my money if the servers were down? I guess Apple maybe collected the money and then charged me, but I had the coins. Like It was so weird because I was building coins and I recorded pretty much the entire thing. I was recording these videos because uh, one video is actually 40 minutes, the other video is 30 minutes, and I uploaded a video today of me opening the packs. So at least I have proof that like, you know, I had X amount of coins and these were, you know, I got a Nissa and I got a Jace. But at the same time, it's like, holy crap, like I played this for less than like, probably less than a few, definitely less than a day, less than half a day. And already it crashed after taking all my monies. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of expect it at this point, but I would love to make, um, hopefully they fix it. I just wanted to make this video because in case, you know, you, uh, worst case scenario, you went ahead and purchased coins because you saw my video and you felt like, oh, hey, I'll play with MTG Lion. Well, MTG Lion cannot used his uh, account anymore and it's been so it's very strange once it um, logged at yourself out it tells you do you want to pick local or cloud and there's like well i don't really know what to pick so i read online that you should pick cloud and wizard of the coast said they pick cloud but it deleted all the decks and the progress and i have and now i can't connect to the server i've tried to reset it but it's really weird obviously um when you pay 25, 26, 27 bucks for a bunch of coins and you spend them all and now it's all gone. All your decks are gone. All your progress is gone. All your multiplayer levels are gone. And you know, it's a fun game, but holy crap, like I don't see this happening in any of my like Final Fantasy online accounts or even when I played EverQuest like a long time ago, like how does this happen? Like and Matt, I can imagine if EverQuest, like all of a sudden people's gold accounts were gone. Or play, uh, let's take WoW. Let's say you're playing WoW, you got your epic mounts, you got your gold collection coins, and then all of a sudden one day it just disappeared and you couldn't connect onto the server anymore. <laughs> I, I don't really know what to say. I, I, I don't really know what to say at this point because I have... I assumed Magic Online was like this, but I didn't assume Magic Duels would be like this. So yeah, I will keep you guys, I'll let you know what the progress is. And I find it fascinating, really, really fascinating that even that a account can be, you know, from a deck to the, to even logging in, it can just be deleted in this fashion uh, within the same day. But then of course they can still collect the money. So, very interesting. I'll keep you guys uh, on the progress, my personal progress. I sent them a few tw tweets. I sent them a Facebook message and I also created a account, which they wanted me to do to send them a customer form. I have the receipt. I even have videos, which is 
kind of interesting because I was recording the entire... I was recording everything while we, I was playing the game and I had a lot of fun because I was going to make a ton of videos. And I obviously tried various ways to try to get my account back and live, but it just didn't happen. So we will see how good Wizards of the Coast's customer service is going to be. And I will definitely report back to you guys. Bye guys.